When students return to class at Rogers State University in Claremore, they'll have to share the campus with some new feathered friends. While they've been away, three new swans are settling into life on the university's two campus ponds. And as Rick Wells shows us new at six, the newbies are getting acquainted with a solitary old bachelor named Sarge. Doesn't he look lonely? Last year, we came to Rogers State up in Claremore, and the student newspaper was having a naming contest for this solitary swan. Sarge. I kind of liked Swan Jovi. I just hated looking at that poor guy by himself. It's Dana Lamb's the past chair of the RSU Foundation. She and her husband, Nash, bought the school three new swans. What do you, Google swans? <laughs> I, I actually did. She found a breeder, then turned the project over to Leonard Chapinski. His staff maintains the building and grounds, including the ponds. So at one time, we had two swans on each of our two lakes. Predators are responsible for the missing swans. Most would acknowledge Sarge has survived, probably because he's just meaner. He's kept us out of our building. We've walked around to the back entrance. There are lots of Sarge stories. Most involve intimidation. He's kept people away from parking spaces, too. He'll, he'll refuse to move. <laughs> well, the new swans have been here about a month, and Sarge's new girlfriend has been a hit from the very beginning. As we've been standing here today, they've been following each other around, so that's a good sign. Who knows where that might lead? Well, we walked over to the other pond and found the new pair there blending into pond society with the Canada geese and the ducks. Uh, I just thought they were fun. So we'll see if that fun leads to any new baby swans, maybe later this year. Rick Wells, News on 6. And when students come back to class next week, the student newspaper up there, the Hill Post, will have a naming contest like they did last year when Sarge got his name. I like Swan Jovi, too. Maybe that one will resurface. Maybe so.